Hello YouTubers, this ski machine here in sunny Soda Springs. Not. Anyways, if you remember in that video of me chasing UP Union Pacific for number 844, you may kind of realize that I ran across this engine here. Now I know it says Dinky Engine, the Dinky Engine, but this engine is half pint. That's right. This is the engine half pint. The one that I based my first video on, and what's the where I narrate the book of said engine. This is him right here. Kind of amazing, isn't it? You know, I came to Soda Springs a while ago, some years ago actually, when I got the book, and I was trying to look for Half Pipe, but I couldn't find him. So, um, down this road over here is a rail crossing. I took a picture of number 844 as it was passing, a couple of them actually. And I stumped, I crossed this engine, I'm like, holy cow, I have got to do a video on this. So I have been worth looking for this engine for some time. Now, there's a little thing that reads that says something about the Dinky engine. It says this miniature locomotive played an integral part. An integral part. A part. Sorry. Sorry for my spelling there. Just, um, I have some wor trouble with words. Anyways, I'm gonna restart. This miniature locomotive played an integral part in the history of Caribou County. When the dam at Alexander Reservoir was built in 1924, it hauled supplies to the dam. Trapped by rushing water, the locomotive was abandoned. In 1976, the reservoir was drained for repairs, and the locomotive was, was uncovered. It was then lifted from its resting place, restored by Union Pacific Railroad, and presented to the city of Soda Springs. Now, here are the people who helped uh, save the train. Boyd Mason. That's this guy here. He's the chairman. Then Thomas Matthias Advertising. Thomas Matthias Advertising over here. Boyd Mason Chairman right here. Adrian Sasser. Jeffrey Jones. And now our thanks to the Century Club members for donating cash labor and materials. That list just goes on. Union Pacific Railroad's at the top. Uh, I unfortunately don't have very much time <laughs> to get this all. I just wanted to show this to you. I thought this was very interesting. I am very surprised I actually came upon this locomotive when I was doing my run with number 844. I'm going to do a quick walk around, just so you can get a, few, a full view of him. Now, I bet you're thinking, wait a minute, this, is a, this looks like a narrow gauge engine. Not true. This engine is actually standard gauge. This is a standard gauge engine. And <laughs> a very small one at that. Hey, look at that. There's its inside. That's the firebox there. It's all green. Not bad. Well, so it looks like the rain is clearing up a bit. Well, that's about it. That's all I can show for now. And so, that is Half Pint for you. This is Key Machine, signing out.